Hello, so welcome to Amazing Days. Today on our segment, we're gonna be doing something different. So we're gonna do breakfast food in an air fryer and then for a little bit of special, we're gonna get something called the tomahawk steak. And right here, this is when I got it the first time way back, I think sometime last year. And then we're gonna cook that on my new grill and then I'm gonna have a friend over because he really wanted to test out the air fryer with the ribeye steak. So we're gonna first have to go buy it we're going to head down to Union Market, because that's the last place I went to find it. I'll see you guys there. Alright, we're finally at Union Market. Let's head on in. All right, so I got a uh, miso ramen for lunch. I'm gonna open this with one hand. Let's do this. Oh, all right. One tomahawk stick? Okay. Oh, getting the tomahawk stick? Thanks. I'm doing a recording of it. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Two and a half pounds. So the for the for the it's gonna be 
for our breakfast part of our air fryer. We're gonna get bacon. We get yeah. two slices of the bacon. And then we're gonna get a sausage. And one of the bacon sausage. Bacon? Yeah, the, oh, the bacon, bacon sausage. sausage. I think it's the one right there. Alright, we're back. I got everything that we need. So, when I was at Union Market, I got our country sliced bacon. So, we got the bacon. We're gonna put this in there. Um, I got ourselves a backwards bacon sausage. So, for breakfast, we're gonna get a hearty meat. Um, we also have eggs. Let me go get that real quick. So we have we have two eggs, one for each ramekin. So we're gonna use the ramekins to cook the eggs inside the air fryer. So that's the best way to do it. Usually, that's also the same way you would do it for uh, baking anything, say like brownies, cake, those things. And I'll also have that a little bit later. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. So real quick. I'm gonna take these out. So this one's a pretty big guy. Check this out. Got that one. And then bacon, we got two slices. Uncooked, of course. Got that bacon. Ooh. Bacon, bacon, bacon. Yeah. So we're gonna put these in. But before we do it, I'm gonna show you how to do the egg. So first. Here, for me, I want to make it scrambled, and so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go get a fork real fast. Scramble the eggs so you guys have a good idea of how it looks. And then I'm gonna add some salt and pepper. For both of them. Get my fork again. Do a little bit of mixing again around there. So I'm gonna do a little bit of zoom up so that you guys can see how it looks on the air fryer. Take this up. I'm just gonna put it right here like so. And it should fit perfectly. So the way it looks inside the air fryer. So I don't spill it on there, so. So yeah, so a better view of it, this is how they would look inside. Yep. So if I get the bacon, I could cook it at the same time. 
against this. So. So don't worry guys, I already washed my hands before the start of this video. So bacon, right here, right next to it. And then, sausage. right here so it should be just enough to be snugged in there and so yeah it looks like a happy face doesn't it sort of like a two eyes mouth boom done all right let's put this in gonna move some of this around move this out i'm gonna put this in so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put it i'm gonna set it for about 10 minutes for 390 degrees and so we're gonna wait all right while we wait we'll do some other things at the same time all right now as we're waiting at this really nice treat for you guys um i don't know how many of you heard of this steak before but i have something called the tomahawk steak in this bad boy look at the shape of it already how big it is so the bone from bottom all the way up to the top. Here it is. How the size of it is on. And I'm gonna open it up like it's Christmas. Right here. Ooh. So this is about two and a half pounds. So I'm gonna show you guys on this. Two and a half pounds for the steak. This thing. It's behemoth of a bone and meat on there. So I'm also gonna show you guys how to cook this. I'm gonna be cooking on a grill this time, not in there. There's no way it's gonna fit in that thing. And so I'm gonna show you guys this real soon after our breakfast food. See you then. Alright, let's check it out. Turn it off for now. You guys hear it? Yeah. Let's see how it looks. Final product. Ooh, so this is how the eggs came out. I'll back that up. So bacon looks really nice. Check it out. What do you guys think? Just by the looks of it. Let me know in the comments below if it looks appetizing or not. I'm gonna grab some tongs. Take it out of there. Sausage look like it needs to stay in a little bit longer just by the looks of it. But bacon for sure is done. It's a little pinch, so I got an idea. So the, the the egg looks like it's pretty much done. So I'm gonna take the eggs out. First. Ooh, shaking a little bit. Oh no. Got it. We'll spread these out. Spread it out. Leave it a little bit longer. I'll flip this over. Put it back in. Leave it in there for another five more minutes. And we will see you guys again a little bit later. All right, sounds like it's pretty much done. Or we'll check up on it. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. Man. 
of sausage. Because the sauce is so big, I'm gonna cook it for a little bit longer. While we wait, put this back in. Let's see how it's gonna taste for this. But yeah, just another look at all this. Don't wanna put it in for too long. It's pretty much done, but I just wanna cook a little bit longer, just in case. But you can see the eggs. Pretty good. Bacon looks amazing. All right, timer is almost up. Let's wait a little bit longer. Looks like it's starting to cool off on its own now that it's almost done. Moment of truth on this sausage. Been in there the longest. Oof, baby. Now this time, for the taste test, I'm gonna bring my wife in with me to try this out together. See you guys at the dinner table, or breakfast table, 